Hi folks, Brian Smith here working on the uh, K. Got a new bottom installed on it. We stained it um, pecan orange color. Um, we uh, put braces on the new bottom. It's made out of birch. Uh, sanded it down. And um, that's what we've been doing, working on the K. The Rogue is done. The Rogue is ready for strings. The K, though, we're still doing a lot of repairs to it. So anyway, we got a new bottom installed. We got braces installed on the bottom. We glued the bottom on last night. And we're doing some repairs to the bottom here that we, our new bottom. And um, there's a little bit of a gap because with the jigsaw we took a little too much wood. And um, that's why someday when I get more money we're going to buy a scroll saw because they have a better even cut. So what I'm doing to fix that is wood filler. Good old Elmer's wood filler. And there you can see I went around and that gap is pretty much gone. I don't care where it's a little thick here. I'm not going to worry about that. Just where it's gappy, where wood's missing. We went ahead and we uh, repaired it. And what we're going to do is we're going to let that dry for 24 hours. And then we got our, um, our 225 grit sandpaper right here. We even got more of that. And what we're going to do is we're going to just go around real carefully and sand that really good, smooth it out so it's flush with the wood. And then after that, uh, we're going to buy a can of dye or a dye stain. And the reason I can this time is because the spray is almost gone. And with the can, you have more control over it. Unlike the spray, I can just go real carefully around with a, with a paintbrush. So um, and then... The other thing we're working on with the K is the neck. Um, it does need a neck reset. We cleaned most of the old uh, glue off. Got a little bit of glue we got to clean off a little bit more. It's a no truss rod uh, style guitar. And um, we got to buy a new fingerboard for it or make a new fingerboard. The fingerboard was dry. It was chipping. It was in bad shape. So I said, screw it took the fingerboard off and we're going to buy a new fingerboard and a set of new machine heads for it so um and uh we're going to have to do a bunch of dry fits on this we're going to have to sand it put some shims in and keep doing a dry fit until it fits in there tight once it fits in there tight and it's where i want it then i can put the glue on so um when we're done done fixing this bottom when the filler dries and we sand it and we put that one last thing of stain on it now we're gonna focus on the uh focus on this neck getting this neck fixed getting a board on it getting some machine heads on it and getting it back in the guitar um so yep that's pretty much the k and what we've been up to on this old k guitar and that's the uh that's the new birch bottom i made out of some birch wood all right we'll keep you posted on the uh k